guys hope you're okay it's sunday we've just had a trip to home bargains so i thought i'd share that with you today hope everybody's all right let me know what you've been up to over the weekend what you've been up to in general well the weather's changed a bit hasn't it so today it's a bit cooler um it's quite raining again to be honest so i've got a big cardio on <laughs> it's actually cold this morning the heating's actually back on so yeah i think the weather's changed now even though it says it's going to be a bit warmer next week hopefully fingers crossed so yeah you might hear a bit of noise in this video because the granddaughter's here my son's here he's probably in the next room to me so you might hear lots of booming voice sounds <laughs> uh yeah so we'll get stuck into the video i'll just show you what we got in home bargains um i'll get i'll do the food stuff first i've got a receipt then i might have to just disappear and put it in the freezer first of all i got some eggs because we use lots of eggs 10 fresh eggs and these were 189 which isn't so bad for 10 and a nice brown colour I feel like brown eggs just make a bit of room then we got some ice cream cones we had these last week and they was really nice so i got some more we got the flakes in um they was 199 which is not so bad for four i've got two of these russell's burgers alex loves these at the minute for a quick dinner um he's in the next room now i can already <laughs> he's dead loud he's got like a his voice is a bit deeper now than it used to be um where is it rustler's big cheese 149 so i've got two because when i'm in work you can have these for lunch time with you know whatever else you fancies i've got some of these holland's steak and kidney puddings i do like these for like with chips and something on a night for tea i had them for ages they was three pound fifteen there's four in it i also got a bottle of pepsi for carl for his dinners at work these pepsi max 79p that was and then i got two of these black currant drinks i don't know if they're any good they might be horrible but they was 39p because i buy so many drinks and they're just dead expensive to buy loads of them so i got two of them i got some cheese and onion sandwich filler we've had this before and it's quite nice we used to buy the morrison's one but it ended up being more mayonnaise than cheese <laughs> so this one's quite nice it's, it's not really watery uh cheese and onion filling that's 139 so that's still a good price i got a little tin of cherry pepsi max and that was 49p i also got some chamomile lotion because carl said that my granddaughter had a little rash on her arm the other day that was bothering her so i thought i'd pick this up got a hair stuck to it and that is 249 it's quite handy to have in in case you know you get bites or anything what's it actually for minor skin irritation and sunburn so yeah we use that one any time and stuff like that andrew picked up some cough medicine that was 169 he always tends to suffer with block sinuses catar so he's always on the cough medicine and i picked up an imperial leather bath soak lavender and wild iris i do like to have a little smell in the shop of them all which one i like best and this this was the best one today i thought so I've got an imperial leather i live in the bath every night i'm in the bath <laughs> i go in there for hours just to escape everybody else um so i do like some nice bath bath stuff um where is it it's my little escape the bath i just love it 199 so that's that bag i'll just chuck that to my side i got a 
buffalo kitchen roll. I use so much kitchen roll. I need to stop it because I know it's not environmentally friendly, but we have a lot of spillages and things. That was £1.49. And I do like the thicker. No, some are dead thin and just useless. You don't mop anything up. I got a Roberts's seeded bread. My favourite bread is the seeded ones. And hmm, what is it? £1.9p, which is really cheap. Um, I've got some of the floor wipes that I always get. You'll have seen these before in my hauls. And these are oh, only 85p. I thought there was more than that because of the big ones. 20 big thick wipes, the citrus ones. And they fit on the, the violin, the mop. We've got some spring onion, golden wonder. These are really nice. One twenty-five here, and we've got a Peter's original traditional pasty. He loves pies and pasties, whereas I'm not the biggest fan. Um, that was ninety-nine p, and he'll probably eat that in a minute. I don't make a Sunday dinner because everybody moans about them. Don't want a Sunday dinner, so I might try to do something through the week that resembles Sunday dinner. I got a tin of corned beef. This was two forty-nine. Just like to add these in because it's quite handy. We've got some more deodorant. Sure. The men's one. I just have a selection in the bathroom so you can use whichever one you want. That was one twenty-five as well. I've got some of these straight to what noodles, which I do like having in. Sometimes Alex will have these for his tea. You know, because he can't wait longer than five minutes for you to make something. Them ones are 79p and there's two individual packs in there. So if you're just having a snack, then one pack's enough. I've got some Galaxy Ripple. Four bars. This is turning into a food haul instead of a home bargain one. But I did I didn't do the best food shopping yesterday, so I thought I'd pick up bits when I was in home bargains. Um Galaxy Ripple, £1.59 for four. I picked up two of these. They all like these in our house. Andrew likes them. Katie likes them. The rhubarb yogurt spike and four shawls, thick and creamy. And I just got two rhubarb ones, which were 39 pence each. He said they're really nice. I got Harvey, one of these jumbo twists, meaty chicken twist. He knows when you've got treats in the bag. He's, he just, his head's in the bag as soon as you walk through the door. God love him. And he is my best behaved child, after all. So he does deserve a treat. <laughs> that was 99p. We got some cherry tomatoes. Um, Piccolo produce of UK. So the UK tomatoes. I don't like having a receipt because I feel like I'm boring. These are 89p. I also saw this, which is brand new. I've never seen it before. Surf Winter Indulgence. Vanilla and Oud. Whatever Oud is. Let me have a little sniff. I've got to try a new surf when I see one. Yeah, it's nice that. You can't decide what the smell is. It doesn't smell overly vanilla. It just smells a bit wintery spicy. So I'm going to have a go at that. I do love a nice laundry detergent. I got some chewies, which were one thirty-five. Two Belvita, one seven, mm, one fifty-nine. They were, yeah, cheaper in there. I think. <laughs> you all know my um, obsession with Belvita. I eat far too many of them. One pound fifty-nine p. So I got two. And that is that bag. Oh no, it's not. Got, we've got these gingerbread pumpkins you decorate your own there's four pumpkins in there and there's some green squeezy icing and some orange sprinkles we had these in a different shade i think it was a gingerbread man the kids loved them it was gone in minutes and i should have bought about three boxes they were one pound 79p but you only get four biscuits and it's more than four of us should have got two for defo
because I didn't do the best food shop yesterday, I just thought, I just thought I didn't get in all bargains. And the one I've just been to is a massive one and they've got everything in. They've got a big food section and stuff like that. So this other bag, I picked up some bath sponges. We use like loads of these as well. These are three pack for 69p, which is amazing. I picked up some heat patches because <laughs> I'm just old and creepy now. Self warming patches, and there's two in each box. Where are they? I got two boxes, but they're supposed to be the third. Oh no, they're not. They're not the same. I wonder why they're in a different box. This is um, a heat relief wrap. So I assume that's a bigger one than this one. It says up to 12 hours pain free and you get two in each box. These are patches, this is a wrap. <laughs> I'll just shove them all on me at the same time. I'm in that much pain, I just can't be bothered. So these, waist and back. It says for waist and back, I assume that's... One was £1.49 and the other was 99p. So I assume those small little patches for smaller areas. Anyway, that's what we got. I got a Grinch advent calendar because Katie loves the Grinch and she loves these, like the ones with the, you know, the cheap chocolate ones. They're not Cadbury's or Galaxy. She loves these ones. And that was a pound, I think. I think it was a pound. But she actually loves them. Yeah, 99p it was. I got a colouring book for Kalani because she loves colouring in and I just pick up on wherever I go in. Christmas colouring book was 99p. She's gone very quiet and wondering what she's doing right now or what her and Andrew are doing because they're both as naughty as each other. I got some sandpaper which was 99p and it's the Spear and Jackson one because I've bought, I've bought um a big what you call them a big welsh dresser from ebay it was a bargain i'm going to sand it all down and paint it hopefully it will fit in my kitchen but it, it is quite big um so that's what these are for but i'm going to buy a sander so it makes the job a lot easier that's the plan coffee pops i love these they're one of my favorites one pound 19 and it's a bigger pattern than what you normally get. They could be gone later. I've got some eye proofing because I'm going through these like sweeties right now. And they were 39p. I also bought this. I only wanted the paper clips, but I couldn't buy paper clips on their own. And the one that I saw on Amazon was dearer than buying this whole pack. So I thought, I'm going to make this crafty thing, which is a hidden paper clip for shoving on the side of your junk journal. So I needed a fairly big, I can't make them, so they're stuck down, that's why. I needed a fairly big paper clip like them. And these was only £1.49 and you get pins, two sizes of paper clip and some little, what do you call them, crocodile clips. So they was £1.49 and I basically just bought them for the big paper clip. Some pretzels. Kids love pretzels and they look, look a bit like a Christmassy bag. Um, 95p. Yep, so they'll just be a snack for whenever. I've got some Whisper. Look at the size of them. Literally like a miniature. You could eat all four in one go. Um, £1.50. No, I could anyway. I got this for the baby, she's here, she can have this after tea. A little Kinder Penguin, I think there's a toy in it. Mm. There's something in there, so I'm assuming there's a toy in the middle. And it was £1.59. These are nice to put in a little stocking filler for Christmas. All kids still love, I still love Kinder Chocolate, I think it's called. And oh, I've got started picking up little tiny Christmas bits now, you know, just little things to shove in the stockings. 
So I'll pick this up for Katie. She loves a notebook. She loves Harry Potter. And I picked up this, which has got a fluffy cover on it. It's like furry owl. And that was, how much was it? I'll not find it now, then. Fluffy notebook. 3 49 it was. She, she, you could buy her literally a bag full of notebooks and she'd be quite happy with that. Everything's <laughs> just on the floor. <laughs> um, as well as that, I got this Dove Relaxing Beauty bag. This is for my mum. This year I'm just giving away everybody money. I don't care because sometimes I can put that much thought and effort into buying people presents and then they don't look as though they've liked them. So everyone's getting money and a little wrap up with the money. So this is for my mum. She's got the Dove Relaxing Bliss. I hope she's not watching this. I don't even know if she knows I've got a channel yet, to be honest. My sister's just found out with my two nieces. And I think they just, my, my sister's like, she doesn't get it. She's like, what are you doing that for? <laughs> so I don't mention my YouTube in, in front of my family. I feel highly embarrassed. So, yeah, I bought this. It was about £5.50 or something. I didn't buy this today. This was last week. So it's not on this receipt. But you get in this body wash, body lotion and antiperspirant and everyone loves Dove. If you don't like Dove, there's something wrong with you because it's just, it's one of them everyday products that everyone loves. So that's my one. I'll probably buy all the bits as well because I just see things and think of people and think, oh yeah, such a body like that, I'll buy it. And I bought this for Katie, it's another notebook, she's obsessed. And it says, I woke up like this and it's Sleepy Beauty. That was about 2 99 or 1 99 But well, I could buy her a box full of notebooks and she would be in her element. So, there you go. Got these. Cozy men's socks. Santas with little pom-poms for the hat. You've got grippies underneath that says ho, ho, ho. I think it was 2 99 These are for Alex's little stocking. I need to get another pair now for Carl's thing. But I don't know if they'll do a size that's like 12 and over. Because he's got massive feet. Yeah, so they're 6 to 11, but I'd need a bigger one than that, I think, for Carl. I'll have to have a look. Um, he has got two bath bombs. This one is for me. A Radox Chamomile. I think it was either 79p or a pound. I do love a good bath bomb. There's a company on Instagram that I follow. I've not bought nothing for ages now, but they're called Vary. V-A-R-I and they do some really nice bath bombs a little bit cheaper than Lush but they're just as good as Lush and I've bought stuff from them before but I think they've been took over by somebody else though because they did a brilliant range of stuff they still do but not as many options now so I don't know what happened with that but yeah I got this one <laughs> I know Alex is 15 but he still likes a bath bomb and I've bought him this this is the Hello Scream Surprise bath bomb, so you get a little squidgy in the middle, little toy. He'll be highly embarrassed, <laughs> especially if his friends are watching this. I'm praying to God that they're not, but he's got a bath bomb. He's always in the bath, like I am. So that's them. Last thing I bought was toilet roll. The big Mickey ones that are four ninety nine, four eighteen. So that's them. Yeah. In a minute, love, I'm coming now. So that's all about in home bargains. Um, yeah, I've not bought any Christmas bits, any autumn bits. But I'm going to do my decorate for autumn this week because the ladders are on the stairs. They're ready for me to go in the loft tomorrow to get all my decorations out. So that's my plan. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please leave me a like, subscribe if you enjoyed the video for more content and I'll see you soon. Take care guys. Bye. So I've just filmed my video and I forgot to add something in that was quite important. I was just going to tell you about a collab that I'm doing with Polly from the All Things Good channel, Polly Johnson. So I watch Polly's videos on a weekly basis, she uploads on a Sunday morning first thing. And she does a, uh, basically a vlog of everything she's been up to through the week. 
she shows her mum in the video, Nancy, who's also a sweet lady. Um, they both have so much fun and they're always up to something. So pop over to Polly's channel, give her a like, say hi. Well, we're going to do a charity shop challenge between us. We've not decided all the details of it yet. But I just wanted to let you know about that before we actually get into that challenge. So you can be following both channels and see what we both get in the charity shops. So I thought I'd just add that on to this video. So, because um, I'm terrible at remembering to say things. Um, so I thought I'd just add that in. Then you can just pop over to Polly's channel. So I will link up. Uh, page in the description box below so all you have to do is click on the link and it'll take you straight over to Polly's channel so I thought I'd just pop on and let you know that before we go bye guys <laughs> 